Here's the deal. Culturally, we recognize two sex designations at birth. Culturally, those two biological sex assignments correlate to two genders. Culturally, we understand gender as binary, meaning there are only two options, your man or your woman. Culturally, we believe men are masculine, women are feminine. Here's the problem with understanding gender as binary. There are as many ways to do gender as there are people in the world. <laughs> Gender is not a social construct. A few people on the internet feel like gender is more of a spectrum like a rainbow than it is as a binary, which is absolutely wrong. And the reason for it is because of culture? Really now? Culture? Okay, let's get this over with. So, before we begin, let's dive deep on what exactly is a social construct. And this is what I got. In the domain of social construction thought, a social construct is an idea or notion that appears to be natural and obvious to people who accept it, but may or may not represent reality. So it remains largely as an invention or artifice of a given society. Now, we gotta ask ourselves, is gender a social construct? And the answer is pretty obvious. No. And here's why. Just because people have different interpretations of what a gender is doesn't really mean that gender is a social construct because gender is backed up with scientific research. We as humans have been studying animals and the human body for years now, if not decades. And now, all of a sudden, people like Ashley Wilde is saying, no, 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 this is all wrong. Why? Because reason. It is scientifically proven that men have XY chromosomes and women have a XX chromosome, right? And this is scientifically proven around the world. It is simple logic. And for those who are you know, have an extra X or Y chromosome or missing a chromosome, that's not a third gender, that's a birth defect. So you're basically wrong. It's not just culturally ingrained that there are two genders, but scientifically ingrained. And before you say about the trans folks, let me just say that it's scientifically proven that people can be in the wrong body. The same thing goes for homosexuality. So, unless you can scientifically prove that gender is a social construct, I'm afraid you're out of luck there, pal! Because we back things up with science, not because of what people feel like. Otherwise, if we were to say that gender is a social construct because it's ingrained socially and culturally in our minds, then would it not be the same thing for sexuality? Because sexuality is also drilled in our heads, both socially and culturally. Like for example, um, in India, there's a lot of people that don't really like homosexuality. Because culturally, and of course socially, it's ingrained in their heads that homosexuality is a sin. And the only way to live your life normally is by being straight. So if you choose the gay life, then you have to be put to death because you are an insult to God. And the same can be said in America. Because not too long ago, our presidents pretty much said that marriage is between a man and a woman. I mean, only recently, Back in 2012, we had the very first president that is in favor of gay marriage. And it wasn't until 2015 that all around the United States, um, gay marriage was legalized. 
Get the picture? Or how about a little step further? Let's go with humanity. Humanity is a social construct because people have different interpretations on what is humanity. For example, in India, when someone dies, they get reincarnated into a cow. And in Japan, some people leave in the circle of rebirth, which is you're going to be reincarnated in one of the six things. Either you're going straight to hell for like a very long time, you get reincarnated into a hungry ghost, into an animal, then into another human, a jealous god, and a divine god. Yeah, crazy, huh? And I'm going to try to send this to many people who consider themselves non-binary. But I doubt I'm ever going to get any feedback because, well, Ashley Wilde pretty much said this. Yes. Narcissism Ahoy! I am the Atheist Gamer! Peace the Game Hi!